Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Georgia64 here, aka the hypocritical gamer. I'm getting in here. And welcome to the next episode of Final Fantasy IX. Alright, so before we go into Memoria, if if I'm remembering that name correctly, I want to get one thing done with, and that is the Stellazios. Now, hopefully, good old Queen Stella can tell me which ones I have and which ones I don't have. I'm really hoping that she does tell me that, because I cannot remember. Alright, here we go, I have Pisces, indeed. Yes. You are most kind, now give it to me. You're welcome. Okay, I want the reward. Rosetta Ring! Awesome! Can you tell me... 10 Stellazio from you, so I should only have like 3 more to find. Can you tell me... Which ones I haven't found yet? I would really greatly appreciate that. Is it in my key items? I would really like it to be in my key items. Koopo Nuts. Give that to uh, somebody. Chocograph piece. Hmm. It does not tell me. Alright, well I still have three more to find. What is this? What? Oh, okay. Well, I found it. <laughs> I found Taurus. There's mist outside now. Why don't you go travel on an airship? Be sure to take some of my pickles with you. Okay, I was waiting for someone to mention the mist. I was talking to everybody here, and they're like talking, Oh, Lindbrom's gonna be better than before. Uh, and, you know, they're not talking about the mist. The other way, to the left. He kept telling me to go to the go right before. Yeah, whatever. Do 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 do. Oh, look at Sagittarius. Good. Gonna go turn these in. Oh, you have Sagittarius. Give it to me for a reward. Yes, indeed. Now give it to me. There you are. Now give me my reward, if you please. You may take the reward from my servant. 30,000 gil, fantastic. All right, a little bit more though. Yes, I have Taurus. There you are, you are most kind. Awesome. Robe of Lords. Wasn't that a prize in the Chocobo minigame? If so, and I just got that, I'm so glad I don't have to uh, do it now, get it now because, man, it required a lot of Chocobo points. Alright, we have received 12 Stellazio from you. And what do you have to say? Something is missing. According to my information, there are 12 Stellazios. Uh, because there's one more. Yes, there must be a 13th Stellazio somewhere. The writings on the Stellazio must be the key to solving the mystery. Well, fine, I'll give you all my Stellazio and you bring me the 13th. I received all 12 Stellazio. Awesome. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, I knew exactly where Sagittarius was because I looked it up. I found Taurus and I was like, I don't want to be looking all over Gaia for the remaining two Stellazio. So I found out where Sagittarius was. I found out that that was the one. I, okay, well, I didn't know for a fact that that was the one I was missing, but I don't. I didn't remember getting it, that one. So uh, I checked that one first. There were others I didn't remember getting, but obviously I did get them because that was the only one. And then I found out that you can only get the 13th one. Obviously, it's going to be Ophiuchus, or however you say that name. I don't know. Ophiuchus. Anyway, obviously, it's going to be that one. I found out you can only get it by having the other 12. So, now I also know exactly where that one is too, because again, I just, I want to get down to things and uh, you know what, it's okay with me, and that's the only, that's the only thing that matters quite honestly. Get in there! Oh wait, that's right, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Alright, and now it should be over here. There it is. Alright, there's something under where the Scorpio used to be. 
Received Ophiocus. Did the Scorpio and the Virgo just sparkle in my hands? Ares. The story of twelve zodiacs. The eleven zodiacs pondered how best to catch Virgo's heart. Ares headed, headed east. Taurus had an idea. He would give Virgo a gift. Through the forest and over the mountain, he found a star. Gemini thought by the river, I will sing her a song. He didn't know where she was, but he hoped his song would reach her. Cancer headed to the cape where Virgo waited. The sun was setting into the ocean. Would he finally see her? Leo was waiting for the sun to set into the ocean. Then Cancer showed up, and they began to fight into the ocean they fell. Watching the sunset from the cape, Virgo whispered, My only wish is to be with you now. Libra was perverse. Was a perverse fellow. He would always walk in the opposite direction of the sun. Would he ever see Virgo? Scorpio was very timid. He always looked at his shadow until one day he decided to look away. He walked up a hill. Sagittarius dashed through the night, defying the chilly northern wind that was stinging his right cheek. Impatient Capricorn ran up a hill toward the sun and fell asleep from exhaustion. Aquarius arrived late. He asked everyone, who kissed Virgo? Pisces said to Aquarius, Virgo made her choice. Go see him and he'll tell you the rest. Ophiuchus said, Their future was uncertain, but Scorpio and Virgo kissed in the light of dusk. That moment meant everything. Alright, awesome! So good for Scorpio and Virgo. Alright, here we are. Oh, you found the last Stellatio Ophiocus. Give it to me along with the rest of the Stellatio I loaned you. There you go. Oh, we're gonna watch them all be put in the cage. Awesome. All right, there we go. You may take your reward from my servant. A hammer! So, yep, indeed we have. I am satisfied. What kind of bird is she, anyway? All right, that's it. I got a hammer. Let's find out what that even does. Is it a weapon? Probably not. You know what? It's probably an item. Is it a key item? No, it is not. Here it is. Cinna's hammer. Oh, it's Cinna. Si uh. Okay. So what if I gave it to him? Apparently, I'm supposed to use it in memoria or something like that. But interesting, I guess. I want to talk to at least talk to Cinna just to see what happens. All right, so Cinna should be here. They're gone. Where'd they go? Where's Cinna and Marcus? Let's go look. Yeah. Wait, Cinna and Marcus didn't go with Baku and Sid, did they? So if Cinna and Marcus are with Baku, then cool. That means I don't have to worry about it, any of that stuff. All right, and here we all are. I have everything I... What is this? Oh, it's a different kind of save point, eh? So apparently, in here, I can actually switch Zidane out. I don't have to have Zidane in my party, which is fun. But I'm gonna keep Zidane in my party just because he's the only person who can steal. Yep. Maybe I should have Quinna. Maybe he can learn some more blue magic. Should probably try that out. But all, all these other guys are lower level than Quinna. Amarant's low level too. Hmm. In fact, Amarant probably has some stuff to learn. I don't think I have anything Steiner is learning. 
As a matter of fact, let's actually check check it out. All right, so we have the Robe of Lords, which makes everything amazing except for magic. And you know what? That's 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 cool. Reflect null. Cool. I'll learn that. All right, and here we have a Rosetta ring, and that uh, allows her to learn concentrate. Cool. Let's find out what these things do. Okay, we're about to get in our first battle. Let's see what kind of enemies that good old Memoria has for us. It has this hulking thing! Alright, let's take this guy down. He looks a lot like the hulking thing that's in Final Fantasy X. Might, huh? Iron Man. Gain more attack power. It's funny you did that because I happen to have something called a power break. Alright, come on! Do something awesome! Miss? Well, that's just stupid. Whatever, here, have some holy. Uh-oh, he's gonna get me! Ouch! Miss! Come on, holy! Let's see what it does! Okay, good. At least that doesn't miss. So, how about a, an armor break, then? That might be good. Looks like this guy doesn't need any sort of mental break. Flare just looks really cool. I like it a lot. Alright, stole another Phoenix down. What is he gonna do? Gain more attack power. Huh, well, whatever. Oh. The bastard put on protect, eh? Well, I'm going to put on, uh, use Carbuncle to give us all Reflect. So, well, let's, uh, actually find out if he has anything besides Phoenix Downs to steal. What do you got for me? And too bad for you that Protect another, uh, carries Phoenix down. Amazing, okay. Protect does not protect you from magic. So there you go. And let's see how good Protect protects you from Steiner's attacks. Oh, so let's see how much Protect protects you from... Dispel! You bastard. Ouch. That hurt quite a bit. But Protect did not protect him enough. Alright, good old Steiner got a level up. And, uh, he also gets an elixir because, nope, nope, not elixir. Don't be stupid. Okay, just go to ability. Echo. For him, okay. And, uh, something. I, I was thinking of something else. I can't remember what it was, but whatever. Let's just keep on going. Now be thorough. Be thorough, me. You gotta pay attention. You gotta examine everything, like that! Uh-huh. Just... Just looking up, huh? Alright, well, that's... A random encounter. <sighs> that's what I get for being thorough. Alright, what do we have here? This evil-looking being. Alright. What do we got? Regen on himself? That bastard. Okay, well, nice try, Ash. 
There's a Pokemon joke there, but you know what? I never even watched or played Pokemon, so I'm not gonna make it. Alright, let's see what Flare does to him, because that's my new favorite spell for Vivi. Okay, he's just gonna keep on putting that on, isn't he? And Vivi is low. Very low. Oh! Oh, I'm an idiot. That's not... That's not region. That's reflect. My bad. Okay, carries a tent. Probably not worth it. Okay, so I'm going to give an ether to VV. Uh oh. Well, great. Will it miss? Hopefully. Hopefully, it, hopefully it'll miss. There we go. Return magic. Haha, <laughs> you bastard. Oh, wait a second. So, Return Magic is not the same as Reflect, so... That's the problem with Return Magic. That's... Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Give an an elixir to Zidon because he has auto life. And full life? Nope. Full life for Steiner. And you know what? We need to kill this guy quickly. Why? Oh, you bastard. Ugh. Don't do Snowstorm again. Okay, at least he's doing Doom. It has the possibility of missing. Now, happening to Zidon. Hopefully it's going to miss. Oh, it's that kind of doom. Yikes. Alright, I'm gonna try it. Cause I'm really hoping that shock is not is not the kind of magic that gets reflected. Uh, it probably is. It's probably gonna kill whoever Oh no! Yay! Oh you bastard! <sighs> that angers me. Yeah, Aiko's dead. Great. Well, at least we have Trance. Alright, there we go. He's dead. That guy was really annoying. I did not like it. And Shock leveled up. Yay! Ugh. All right, anyway, off we go. Of course, let's just keep on examining things. Just not examining, but you know, hugging the walls to see if there's anything to examine. Uh huh? So far, no. I think this thing is new. It definitely looks crazy looking. Oh, the truth sheet's offline. That's too bad. Goodbye, the truth sheet. It's a chimera! Of course. Let's see how Flair does. Give Kiraga to everybody. Just some normal attacks for the other two. Should be fine. Uh-oh. Venom Breath? That's no good. Vaccine for Vivi. Eventually, you know. There we go. Okay, now... Actually, I think, I'm pretty sure I have... Oh, yeah. Panacea. Uh-huh. Yep. Good. For Vivi. And just normal attacks. If, again, if you please.
Uh oh. Virus crunch. What is? Why are you always picking on BB? There we go. Well, at least he's dead. All right. Let's just keep on looking, examining everything. Oh, I hate random encounters. Well, lucky for you guys. Um. Oh, I just got a message from Lucigi or Lucigi. I'm not exactly sure, but I'll read that after this. That was just way too quick. Let's just continue. What's this? Nothing. I'm trying to be thorough, guys. I really, really am. Uh, I really hope I'm just not being a dummy and missing stuff. That would really suck. But this place looks really cool. <sighs> what? Wait, hold on. What? What is it? Huh? What is going on? Why is there boss music? Are there just random encounter bosses? Or was this actually like something that happens on that branch? We meet again. We do? I am one of the Chaos Guardians. Oh, okay. <laughs> Kneel before my power. So we have to fight our memories because we're in Memoria. It's like memories that we created, right? So. Maliris. Alright, so this is Aiko. So Aiko will. Uh, nope, nope. Uh, okay. Aiko shall. Do. Actually, no, I choose Carbuncle. Flame Slash! Uh oh. Wow, that was cool looking. Maliris, what do you have for us? Okay, I want to see Zidane do your thing. I want to know what we have before I go all out on this guy. Masamune. Ultima Sword. Genji, Genji armor. Or no, Genji armor. Okay. Um, well, in that case, let's give Steiner a high potion. And we'll give him another high potion. And we will steal. I'll get back to you when I... Ooh, careful of that sword, Quiver. Okay, so maybe Kiraga for Steiner then. Anyway, I'll let you guys know when I get some cool stuff. Like the Genji armor! Oh, no! I'm an idiot! All right, I think I got everything. I want to steal with Zidane one more time, but I am going to start just do normal attacking. Let's... Oh wait, that guy has um, Reflect on. Oh wait, Shock bypasses Reflect, that's right. So just... Let's wait to see what he does. Okay. How much does that hurt? Miss! Awesome, so defend with him, steal with uh, Zidane. And we're going to dispel. Dispel with good old Echo. Alright, doesn't have anything. Okay, I got everything. There we go. Awesome. What do you mean, miss? What do you mean by miss? Did it reflect right as I... Did, did reflect wear off right as I used it? Because that's stupid on my account, because <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. All right, let's do a little bit of a phoenix on this guy. Bring us back to put auto life on us or something. Now, this guy's not doing so well. Let's just do a normal attack. Rebirth flame, very good. All right, what do I want to do here? Let's inflict some... What does this do? Non-elemental damage and poison. Okay, yeah, let's do bio. Let's do bio on this guy. Oh, no! Oh, no, that means I'm gonna do bio on me! Oh, man. Ah, dispel. Great. 
Amazing. All right, well, I'm going to give an antidote to Aiko, who is not poisoned or venomized, so never mind. Normal attack will be fine. Yes, dispel, please. I really wanted to put bio on him, so let's try that again. It's not, it's not too terribly strong, but I don't really care. Let's do some thievery. Oh man, Aiko needs to be healed. All right, well, I will do that now. Uh oh. Oh wait, no, that's not right. I thought that for some reason I thought this was the last move. All right, who is this, Steiner? Okay. Let's try some sword magic, maybe? Uh, no, nah, let's do sword art. Let's see if I can get Thunder Slash to hit. Probably not, but who knows? Stranger things have happened. Zadon should be fine. Alright, let's see. Let's, uh, let's hit the guy with some Demi. That'll be fun. What's he doing? Okay, Thunder Slash. Come on, Steiner, you can hit! Okay, no you can't. Okay, that's the last time I'm gonna try that. Alright, let's go for some Holy. Unfortunately, Demi missed. That's a shame. Nice! Guard against that. Let's just hit him with a good old-fashioned flare. Hopefully the holy will kill, though. I'd like to preserve as much MP as I have. Yep, it killed him. Awesome. Down you go. It's over. Take this! What is he doing to us? Raiding swords? Oh, no. Okay, well, it wasn't that bad. Man, what a dick. We were on a bridge and everything. All right. Phoenix Pinion. Nice. All right, so let's continue on. Okay, what do we have here? Hmm, a cutscene, maybe? Yup. Isn't this Alexandria? What is Alexandria Castle doing here? Huh? What the hell? Was that like... that? Oh, those, those are our memories again, okay. That was when Bahamut attacked and then with Alexander. What? What do you talk about? I not see anything. Of course you can't see anything. You weren't with us at the time, so it's not in your memory. Yep. Uh, okay. Okay, so this must be, um, what's her name? Oh man, what is her name? I can't remember the queen's name. Braun, Queen Braun's name. Okay, uh, uh, this must be her, so. In his bid to defy me, Kuja tried to acquire Alexander. An incident ten years ago started everything. Uh-huh. Alright, cool. Anything else? No? Alright. Just keep on going. Everything seems pretty straightforward. I've really tried to examine as much as possible. What is this? Man, those guys are brutal. I think they're called Ash. Maybe that's something else that's called Ash. They're really brutal. <laughs> okay, through those doors. A storm? Oh, this is Burmacia memory. It's totally... Oh, oh, oh. What's this? 
<laughs> okay. Same as last time. Nothing. Oh, man. Oh. All right. Anyway, I really am trying to be thorough, guys. What? Hey, what are you doing? You shouldn't go anywhere there's a storm. Maybe this is, um... Dagger and her mother's arrival to, uh... To Alexandria. Watch out, you're gonna get washed away! But if so, how is the Don seeing this? Only people of those... Dagger, I just saw a little girl on a ship and... Huh? I guess it was my imagination. Uh, yeah, it had to be. What I just saw definitely isn't one of my mem memories. What's going on? That was my memory. Why was Zidon able to see it? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Zidon! Yeah, what's up? You didn't imagine anything. Wait, you saw it too? That means that little girl was you. But why was I able to see something from your memory? I don't know. Hey, Garland! What's going on? Oh, that person talking to us was Garland. I'm an idiot. Whatever. Garland, can you hear me? I feared Ku Gaia's idolons more than anything. However, I decided to deal with them before they became a major problem. Uh-huh. I would like a save point. Because I'm scared to go any further. What is that thing? That eye. It's the same eye I saw on the night of the storm at sea. Yeah, it's the eye to the invincible. Zedon, can you hear me? Zedon, what you just saw was from your memories and not Garnet's. What? I don't remember ever being in a storm at sea. Was he still the eye? Was he the eye or something? Maybe the eye's not from the Invincible. I don't know. And I know I'm doing Garland's voice wrong. For some reason, I can't remember place on how I remember doing it. I'll have to go to an earlier episode to remember. You still don't understand. You will find out soon enough. What do you mean? Can other people's memories become a part of my own? Garland! Once you accept everything, the answer will appear before you. Okay. A tremendous force was summoned to Gaia during the Age of War. However, the Gaians were not ready to harness so great a power. They were terrified and broke the jewel into four pieces. And they prayed never to see it again. Uh-huh. Alright, cool. Anything else? No? No random encounters? Ugh. I knew it! I knew it was gonna be a boss fight! Guys, I really am trying to look for stuff. I'm just so worried, so scared that I'm not finding it. So you have defeated Maliaris. For Tiamat, there is only victory! Who oh, is there? Float, huh? Hmm. Alright, well, let's just, uh, kick this guy. No, 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 hold on. On second thought, let's... Let's get some reflect going on, just in case this guy has some powerful magic. And let us find out what Tiamat has to steal. Jetfire. Thanks. Alright. What do you got, Tiamat? Let me know! Grand Helm, Feather Boots, Blood Sword. Okay, I have Grand Helm and Feather Boots. I don't think I have Blood Sword. I might not have Grand Helm. I actually am not sure now. Hmm. Oh well. Uh oh, what's he doing? Well, wonderful. Zidon should bring himself back. No, wait, no. He has. He doesn't have uh, that on anymore, so I have to bring him back myself. Bring him back. 
All right, I got everything, guys. Now I'm just gonna take him down. Absorbing the strength, if you please. Yeah, guys, I'm really not gonna hold back for this one. I wanna... I need to quickly get to a save point. So I'm just... I, I am going to be using all of my strongest attacks on this guy. Alright, come on, Flare! Do good damage! Yep, so this is not going to be very exciting to watch, but I'm trying to hurry up, so that's kind of what's on my mind right now. Okay, let's do some more Flare. I don't think I can make this guy float. Yeah. <laughs> Got some thievery do going on. Let's see what we can do with it. Uh huh. Alright. Oh, no, there we go. That did it. Okay. Very good. Very good. I have two more of those things to fight. I'll take the wing edge and the 10 AP. And hopefully, up by this eye, there will be a save point. I could really go for something like that. Uh huh. What is that smoldering thing right there? There's lots of smoldering stuff. Ugh. All right, let's see here. Can't examine anything. It's very straightforward. Continuing onward. Okay, this, this might be something. Nothing right there. Uh-huh. Why is it just looking? I do not know. Okay. This is really starting to worry me. Oh, I look like I could go on those stairs. All right. Looks like I can't go that way. I can only go up. Okay, anyway, let's keep on going. What is this? It looks like the merging of two planets. Blue and red, Gaia and Terra. Two moons colliding? No, they look more like planets. Why does this look so familiar? That is a picture of Gaia being assimilated by Terra. 5,000 years ago, Terra already an old planet sought to assimilate Gaia. Terra needed to merge with a younger planet to survive. However, there was already life on Gaia, and so the story began. Oh yeah, I saw this in Wilvert. Yeah, you did. Life on Terra was coming to an end. We had no choice but to proceed with the fusion, which tragically destroyed Terra's native civilizations. Terra was too old to assimilate everything. Thus, I created the Aoife Tree to regulate the flow of souls back to Terra. Interesting. How was Wheelvert created in the first place? I don't know. And I was walking sideways, by the way. Just pointing that out. Climbing up, I guess. Oh, yes! Okay, guys. Please, 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 please tell me if I missed anything. I mean, 
There are those places where I kind of was looking around and that's all I did when I examined it. I'll go back and get it. Alright. I'm just very worried about stuff. Anyway, I'm really glad this was here. But that is all the time we have for this episode. So until next time, this has been Georgia64, aka The Hypocritical Gamer. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time!